I think Happy Corbin is the luckiest man in WWE. Why? I would agree with that assessment. Let's talk about this, Cole. From riches to rags, back to riches. How can you not be inspired by Happy Corbin? He doesn't have to rub it in our face. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Kansas City. Weighing in at 275 pounds. Happy Why can't this guy be humble? I don't get it. Why be humble, Cole? Happy Corbin has never been richer or happier. Listen, Saxton has no money, and he doesn't say anything about it. Corey, you've got all the money in the world, and you don't brag about it. So why does Corbin have to do it? It's a matter of personal choice. Nicer clothes, faster cars. Corbin has always lived large, just now larger than ever. You think Corbin will give me a ride in one of his fast cars? The age of Alexander continues. And his opponent from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 200 pounds, Cedric Alexander! Obviously, this man's grown cocky. He doesn't respect the locker room veterans. But Cedric Alexander does possess the skills to back up the aforementioned cockiness. Cedric Alexander, former Cruiserweight champion, former Raw Tag Team champion. And listen, he's got a bright future. And Happy Corbin set for action. Hopefully he realizes this match is no laughing matter. <laughs> oh, come on, Cole. They say laughter's the best medicine, and Happy Corbin has never been healthier. Well, change here with this matchup. Corbin is a vicious competitor, but he's had issues with keeping his eye up at the top. Oh, oh, drop. Good Lord. Yeah. Caught with a big boot. On the mark. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Cedric Alexander is quite the athlete, so agile, so impactful. Corey, how do you handle an opponent quite like Alexander? Definitely not by trying to beat him in a battle of speed or agility. Instead, you need to dictate the pace. Slow things down so Cedric can't get into the rhythm he wants. Can't get the control that he wants. Corbin fights back. Drops him with a big shoulder tackle. Stopping down. He gets set down to the floor. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Let's just all take a moment to truly appreciate and embrace Two. his presence. Three. And it's Cedric Alexander sent flying from the top. Good Lord, taking flight. And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. Wow, what an arm drag. Here he comes, sliding back in. And he sends him into the corner. Wicked clothesline. Big six from the Lone Wolf. And landing with the double axe handle. Pulling him in for the breaker. Right to the lower back. Oh, no. 
believe this. I can't believe the nerve he's got interrupting this matchup. You shouldn't be surprised, Saxton. This superstar only cares about one person himself. Watch out, watch out. Gutsy performance. Keeps collecting losses.